皆さん、こんにちは。Welcome to the second lesson of Unit 3. So, in this, in this lesson, we're going to be focusing on the use of particles. So, as a topic one, we're going to be learning this new particle called、uh, mo. So, how do we use it? Is that basically the meaning of mo is like as well or to in English also? Probably easier if you look at these examples. This one, Emi san wa. This should be okay. Amy will buy shoes. Now, what if Amy san buys something else? And she will buy a bag too. Notice that when、uh, we were talking about shoes, but she buys, she buys the shoes, but she buys a bag as well. So、uh, the particle o was replaced with the mo. カバンも買います。Buy the bag too. Another example. 私は明日大学に行きます。I'm going to college tomorrow. But the second sentence is 友達も大学に行きます。My friend also is going to college too. So here, 私 I am going to college, but my friend is also going. So that 私は is replaced by 友達も。So why is replaced with も So, when、uh, certain things or people share the same property or doing the same thing, when there's like an overlap, we replace the particles with the mo. Kaban, a kutsu o becomes kaban mo. Watashi wa becomes tomodachi mo. Also,、uh, in topic two, we can also still talk about the particles, but in this time, we're going to focus on the time expressions. And there are times when、uh, in Japanese,、uh, time expressions need a particle or when they don't need a particle. So, how do we tell them when to use a particle, when not to use a particle? So,、uh, you can compare these two sentences. So, I watch a movie at 10. I watch a movie today. So, you notice that they're, they're, all, they're both talking about watching a movie when, but、uh, the sec- first sentence does have a particle, but the second sentence doesn't. No particle. The difference between a sentence that needs a ni and a sentence that doesn't is that whether the time is a specific or rather a relative. So, when you think of juji, that's a specific time. Like, juji is 10, at 10 o'clock, is always 10 o'clock. Juji. So, when you're dealing with a specific time, you need the ni. But if you think of kyo today, kyo is a relative time. Like,、uh, when exactly is today? Is that, for example, if today was January 1st, then、uh, today will be January 1st. But tomorrow, I would say today is January 2nd. So, the specific date of today is relative to the course of time. So,、uh, today or tomorrow, or like,、um, So, these time today or tomorrow, like this year, those times are called,、uh, considered relative to other t i m e So, for these relative times, don't need a particle ni. So, kuji ni, ginko ni, ginko e, ikimasu. That needs a particle because kuji is very specific time. Kyo, eiga o mimasu. Kyo today is a relative time, so no particle. Final one is just an extra,、uh, another important、uh, particle. Kara made. So, kara and made, those are set. Toshokan wa gozen hachiji han kara gogo kuji made des. So, kara made des. This is from until. Library opens from 8 30 to 5 pm. Hachiji han kara gogo kuji, gogo goji made des. So, these time expressions,、uh, the ones that need a particle, that、uh, expressions that don't need a particle, and also kara made. So, in the lesson, let's、uh, learn and practice these different time expressions using or not using particles.